an MDC Alliance councillor in Bulawayo, Joyce Ndlovu, has said MDCT President Douglas Munzara is dull if he believes that he has the support of the party's councillors in the city. Ndlovu, who is the Ward 2 councillor, attended a caucus meeting of the Citizens' Coalition for Change CCC, two weeks ago. The CCC caucus was chaired by former Bulawayo Deputy Mayor Tinish Kambarami and former Bulawayo Senator Matson Lalo. The caucus reportedly discussed a possible move for the councillors to pass a vote of no confidence against the city's town clerk, Christopher Dube and the mayor, Councillor Solomon Nguni. In leaked audio to the councillors' WhatsApp group, CLR Ndlovu accused MDC Alliance councillors of being sellouts, claiming that the majority are planning to ditch Munzara just before the 2023 general elections. Ndlovu said, I have a question Bulawayo councillors, I will exclude two people, or just maybe one from this group, and the person I will remove is the chief whip, CLR Silas Chigara. I will exclude you chief whip because you stand for what you say. People have been accusing you of causing the recall of councillors until we realized that you are innocent and you have clearly stated that you are a member of the MDCT. What I would like to know is who exposed me, that I attended the CCC caucus, who leaked, I am asking, who exposed me. I would like to say the truth right now and right here that even the MDCT president Munzara is dull, if he was clever he would recall all the sellouts from Bulawayo. In this group there is not even one councillor going with Munzara, the majority of you are saying they will leave him during the last days of your terms. Ndlovu further claimed that there were some MDC Alliance councillors who attended a meeting with CCC leader Nelson Chamisa in Harare recently. When contacted for a comment by the Sunday News, Ndlovu confirmed that she was indeed the one speaking in the audio and stood by what she said. Reports suggest that the majority of MDC Alliance MPs and councillors across the country now support Chamisa after Munzora's party failed to win a single parliamentary seat or ward in the 26 March by elections. Just to be